Hey, what up everyone? I'm Cine Cool, and this is Gems of War. And today I have your spoilers for you uh, for November 1st, 2021. We're out of October and into November with these spoilers. So let's get right into it. Uh, this is for PC, mobile. Please subscribe. It's the red button. I'd really appreciate it. We're trying to get to 5K. Xbox and PS4. Then after that I'll do Nintendo Switch because I love you guys out there. Guys and gals. Uh, October, or, uh, November 1st, 2021, all platform spoilers. Weekly event spoilers. PC, mobile, Xbox, PS4. Let's go. In the background here, I'm just doing normal daily stuff, but it's kind of interesting because we get the Flesh Horror. We do a level 500, uh, the Black Heart, and we do some uh, Vault Keys. So hopefully you get to see all that. I'm not sure. It depends how fast I do this, but uh, let's go. What do we got going on? New Kingdom coming soon. Not next week, though, so... But the week after that, maybe, I think. Something like that. The 15th, the 12th, somewhere around there. Um, but not next week. So let's go over next week. World Event, Monday, November 1st, 2021, for uh, the Pride Lands. Uh, the name is Hunting the Leocorn. Arcane Metal is 160% spell damage for all troops in the current event. Um... Leo Corn comes into the game. We have a Pride Lands week next week. Does that mean a Rope Dart? Is that Rope Dart? Pretty sure, right? Uh, Faction Assault Tuesday, November 2nd for Endrajit's Palace. Pet Rescue Wednesday, Son of Tau from Pride Lands. Uh, class Event Thursday is Sun Spear. Sun Spear's pretty good. Uh, pretty close to a top 5 class. Firestorm, all that good stuff goes great with... Uh, the um, Flamifer or uh, Yao Gui, Queen Titania, any of that kind of stuff. Flame, it's got Fireblade on it, so pretty good class. And then we have the Vault Event Friday, so that's great. Uh, Vault Event has pretty much replaced uh, Ferris Ra for soul farming, and uh, that's the way you get most of your resources these days, is Noma Palusers in the Vault Event. So save up your verses, and let's get it this weekend. Uh, so to reiterate, World Event, Pride Land, Spell Damage, Faction Assault, Indrigit's Palace, Pet Rescue, Son of Tau, Class Event, Sun Spear, and this weekend, Vault Event. Pride Lands Week, that means Rope Dart, pretty sure. Alright, let's go check out the new troops for PC, Mobile, Xbox, PS4. I should just say PlayStation, right? Because it's PS5, too. All right, Monday, November 1st, 2021, from Pride Lands, we get Leo Corn, Magical Kitty Saves the Day. Arcane Blood, Base Rarity Epic, Troop Type Beast, Mystic, Troop Roll Support. It's a Unicorn Lion. Uh, noble Enchantment, create three wild cards. If an ally is enchanted, gain an extra turn, then enchant a random ally. Mana Color Blue Red, Mana Cost 10. Uh, trait number one, Beast Bond. Trait number two, Wild Magic. 25% chance to create a times two wild card when matching four or more gems. Trait number three, Spell Armor. Reduce damage from spells by 25%. Doesn't sound terrible. Three wild cards, and then if an ally is enchanted, you get an extra turn. Then you enchant a random ally. So if you could get your whole team enchanted somehow, let's say... I wonder if that works with potions. Uh, Friday, November 5th, 2021, from Zay Jin, we got Flaming Oni. That's our new mythic, by the way. It's the beginning of the month, so we get a new mythic. Uh, Flaming Oni is from Zayjin. My Little Oni. Arcane Beast and Lava. Base Rarity Mythic. Troop Type Daemon Goblin. Troop Roll Generator. Most likely will be on the thumbnail. Along with the Lion uh, Unicorn there, hopefully. Uh, let's take a closer look at it, and I'll describe. He looks like, kind of like Bebop or Rocksteady. But more of like a caveman. And uh, yeah, you'll see him on the thumbnail. Um, he's a daemon goblin. So he's a big goblin demon. Goblin horde. But he looks like, like Bebop or Rocksteady in my opinion. His uh, spell is goblin horde. Summon three random goblins. Then explode magic plus one green gems and gain an extra turn. That sounds amazing. Mana color green, red, brown. Mana cost 22. Save up your keys now, y'all. Trait number one, Song of Fire. Summon a Firestorm at the start of battle. Already starting off good there. Trait number two, Fireproof. Trait number three, Red Rage. Convert two red gems to burning gems when my turn begins. What is a burning gem? We're getting burning gems. 
Do you match them and they get burned? Hmm. You blow them up, they get burned? That'd be cool. I would probably wouldn't want to match a burning gem, but uh, if you could uh, blow them up, like he blows up green, if you blow them up, that's cool. He probably burns too then. Might as well add that to the list of stuff he's doing. Burning. So he sounds really good in my opinion, uh, just from the text. So we don't know yet what kind of tier he is, but he looks like a nice A or S tier there. Um, summoning three random goblins. Goblins are usually good. They have extra turns. Then explode magic plus one green gems. That's good. And gain an extra turn. So explodes a bunch of green and gains an extra turn and summons and burns and summons a firestorm and see and 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 and. That's what you want with a mythic. Anyway, sounds good. Save up those keys till Friday. Weapon spoilers, PC, Mobile, Xbox, PS4. On Friday, November 12th. Okay, so nothing. Class spoilers, on November 19th, we're getting Elementalist, remember that. Kingdom spoilers, November 15th, The Nexus. So we'll have a big spoiler video that week. Uh, pet spoilers, on Monday, November 1st, from Silverglade, we're getting Kitterfly, it says. It's from the uh, campaign, Talisman of Wild Magic campaign. Uh, it's a cosmetic purple pet. So, I probably won't get it, but anybody paying for the campaign will. Or they already have, I don't know. Alright. Let's do uh, Max Kingdom Power. PC, Mobile, Xbox, PS4. So sounds like a cool week, guys. We got Vault of It. We got an awesome new Mythic. Uh, Sun Spear. And Spell Damage for the World Event, so nothing annoying. Uh, sounds good. Sounds like a nice, like, not not too busy, but with awesome stuff. So, new Mythic and Vault. Alright, on November 1st, 2021, Pride Lands Kingdom Power goes to 21. On the 5th of November, Zayjin Kingdom Power goes to 22. Okay, so yeah, that's the uh, spoilers for PC, Mobile, Xbox, PS4. Uh, remember to like, share, subscribe, consider joining, it helps a lot. Tell your guild about the channel, comment below... I'll see y'all tomorrow. But yeah, new mythic, save up those keys. Vault event, save up those verses. And uh, Pride Land, so rope dart. Rope dart, new mythic, vault event. Alright, let's go into Nintendo Switch spoilers for my unicorns out there. Weekly event spoilers for November 1st, week of November 1st for Nintendo Switch. Alright, you got... On Monday... November 1st, you have the world event called Fungal Growth. Mushroom Metal, 160% spell damage for all troops in the current event. Sorry, I had to clear my throat. So, spell damage, Fungal Growth, world event, Zayjin, uh, Fun Dingus, uh, Faction Assault Tuesday, Amnathrax, Pet Rescue Wednesday, the third Black Beast skin from Zayjin. You guys are having a Zayjin week. That means, uh, High King Iron Gut, right? Uh, Thursday, class event for Thief. Thief is good. Skeleton Key. Uh, Friday, Invasion. Invasion for Adana, and the troop that comes in is Ted1000. Alright, so, yeah. You guys are getting a Zayjin week. That's good. Uh, Fundingus isn't bad either, so Fundingus and, uh, High King Iron Gut and Thief class, so pretty good. Troop spoilers for Nintendo Switch. Uh, Fundingus comes in on Monday, November 1st, 2021 from Zayjin. It says, Fungal in the Jungle. Arcane Beast, base rarity, epic, troop type, elemental goblin, troop roll generator. Uh, his spell is Purple Spores, Explode Magic Plus One Purple Gems, then summon either a Giant Toadstool or an Explode Stool. Gain an extra turn. He's kind of like the new Mythic, but, you know, lower rarity and everything. Mana color green, red, mana cost 14. Uh, trait number one, Immune, Disease and Lycanthropy. Trait number two, Plague Touch, Disease when doing Skull Damage. Trait number three, Poison Spores, Inflict Poison when I take Skull Damage. Um... Friday, November 5th, 2021, your guys' mythic is from Cinemirage. Uh, it's called The Scourge of Honor. 
I smell a rat. Arcane, forest, and lava. Base rarity, mythic. Troop type, daemon, wild folk. Troop roll, mage. Uh, vermin plague is the spell. Deal magic plus four true damage to all enemies. Gain two mana back for each cursed or diseased enemy. Mana color green, red, brown. Mana cost 22. Trait number one, immune, disease, and lycanthropy. Trait number two, omen of nature. Explode a green gem at the start of battle. Trait number three, rat swarm, curse, and disease. A random enemy when matching four or more gems. So the Scourge of Honor, he's not a bad mythic. He's not the best mythic. But he has that rat swarm, which isn't bad. Curse and disease, a random enemy, a magic four or more gems. It's a way to curse. He does true damage. We like true damage. Um, he gains two mana back for each cursed or diseased enemy. So he's not bad, but he's not great either. He's probably, he's definitely in the top half. So if we split the mythics, you know, right down the middle and said these are good and these aren't good, he would be in the good side, I would say. But he's not like a top 10. He's probably not a top 15. He struggle to get into the top 20, but he's close. Uh, and that is it. But hey, Scourge of Honor's not bad. Fundingus is good. You guys, getting a couple decent troops there. Weapon spoilers, Nintendo Switch. Friday, November 5th, from Adana. You get the Engineer's Drill. This thing's good. Rarity, Legendary, Weapon Type, Dagger, Weapon Roll, Generator. Um, mana color, Blue Green, Mana Cost, 14. Uh, the spell is Explode, Magic plus one, Brown Gems, Grant a random status effect to all mech allies, then summon a mech troop. So it's one of those explodey weapons that grants a good status effect to your certain uh, typing of ally, and then it summons that same typing of ally. So usually those are good. Cobaltine 1, Fist of Heaven, Engineer's Drill, uh, there's a bunch of them now. A Boreal Crystal, and they're all decent. You should definitely get it. Uh, it has Armored, which is gain for armor. Mechanical, give all me uh, mech allies one armor. Striking, deal five damage to the first enemy. And powerful, gain four mana. So hey guys, you're getting solid stuff this week. It's above average, it's good, decent stuff. Engineer's Drill, Scourge of Honor, and Fun Dingus. Make sure you get all three of those. With the Scourge of Honor, you know, if you don't get it, it's not the end of the world. Uh, weapon spoilers. Did I already do that? I think I just did. Whoops. Groundhog Day. Class spoilers for Switch. You guys are getting Elementalist, but not anytime soon, it doesn't say. Kingdom spoilers for Switch. Durgaroth on November 12th is your next faction. Pet spoilers for Switch. Uh, nothing till November 12th. Um, then you have Max Kingdom Power for Switch. See what your power's looking like. On the 1st of November, Zayjin Kingdom Power goes to 21. And on the 5th, Zayj uh, Sin of Mirage Kingdom Power goes to 12. And that is it. So yeah, solid week for everyone. Nintendo Switch, you guys, you got a Zayjin week. That means uh, High King Iron God, I'm pretty sure, right? I always get him confused. It's like either Zayjin or, or uh, Zolkari. And I always forget which one it is. It's one of the Zs. You know, he's one of the Zs, I think. So I'm pretty sure it's Hiking Iron Gut, but double check me on that. I'm not always right about everything. I'm not an encyclopedia of Gems of War. 99% of the time I'm right, though. Uh, what else? So Hiking Iron Gut, Fun Dingus. Um, what else did I say? Engineer's Drill. Um, there was something else, but you guys I already said it. So decent stuff. Scourge of Honor was the other thing. So, decent, decent stuff for y'all. And then over on the uh, PC, mobile, Xbox, PS4 side, we got Vault Event, an awesome new mythic it looks like, and we get Rope Dart, pretty sure. So, pretty awesome for everybody, and the weeks aren't super packed full either. So, cool stuff, good stuff, fun stuff, but not super packed. That's what I like. So, this is the kind of week I would like to have every week. New mythic, Vault Event, and Smooth Week. So, but anyway, remember to like, share, subscribe, consider joining, it helps a lot. Tell your good about the channel, comment below, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the weekly preview. Tuesday for Teams Tuesday. Wednesday for a new account playthrough live stream, which is pretty not pretty much not new anymore. It's just a normal live stream for Gems of War. But hey, with beginner, it's beginner, you know, heavy. Like, more beginner advice. Um, 
Thursday will be Sekiro, 10 a.m. EST live stream. Friday will be our main account, uh, Vault Event live stream. New Mythic, New Mythic, New Mythic uh, live stream. So be there or be square. That's the schedule for this week. And yeah, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Sekiro later today, though. I have one recorded, so I'm going to put it out later today. But yeah, love you guys. Have a great week. Happy Halloween. And you're the best. Peace.